Hi everyone, so today I'm going to unbox this Garmin Drive Smart 65. This is top of the line GPS navigation device from Garmin, which is number one GPS navigator company in the world. So let's see what's inside the box and then I will um, configure and register the, the this device and update the map using my computer and internet. So let me open the box first. So we have this uh, Garmin device itself. This has a 6.95 in touch screen. That's bigger than any other GPS device you use for uh, navigation. On the back side, if you look at the device, it has power key and it has the USB power and data port and it has map and data memory card slot. And then you also have microphone for voice command and hands-free calling. So, and also uh, this section is for the vehicle suction uh, cup mount. So let's see what's else in the box. So we have this uh, vehicle suction cup mount, then we have uh, power cable, and then this is the USB cable, and then we also have this uh, quick start manual. So let's set up this device. So let me remove the sticker first. This looks like a really nice screen. So to get started, I will first connect the uh, device with my computer using Garmin's USB cable. Now take the big end of the USB cable and plug it into your PC. You can take the small end of the cable and plug it into your device like this. Now I'll open the internet browser to set up this uh, device. Now I will go to garmin.com slash express. So once you are at Garmin's website, click download for Windows or Mac depending on the system you are using. I am using Mac so I will download the Mac version. Once this file is downloaded, run that file. Now check the box agreeing to terms before proceeding to install the software in your PC. Open the application when the installation process is finished and add your device. This will allow Garmin Express to recognize your device anytime it is connected to your computer. Now I will register my device by adding my email address in the box. You can use your email address and then select next. Now I'll add a nickname to my device to make it easier to identify my device. So we have the option to share the device data with Garmin. So now select install all. This will start the update process, but we must agree to the terms and condition and review more important notes before selecting continue and the device may require a software update so completing a software update may require you to follow a few instructions including disconnecting and restarting your device so garmin express will indicate when the update is successfully completed and once complete you are free to unplug your device and that's it 